I'm going to take you on a little journey to Hawaii. Here was my first mistake. Make sure you keep both tickets. Right now, there's no one on the Shinkansen, so social distancing is very easy. This is one of the safest ways to travel. It's such a smooth ride that you don't even feel like you're going 320 kilometers an hour. So I was hoping for the Hogwarts trolley to come along um, with some unique Harajuku-style candies and funky flavor beans, but I can't function anymore without my coffee beans first thing in the morning, so this will do. Okay, so I get off the Shinkansen at Shinkobe Station, only to realize that my bus is just pulling away. And then I hear kids laughing. I follow the sound, and under the Shinkansen tracks, I find all of these people laughing and playing in the water, cooling off, which is when I realize I'm thirsty. I try to avoid using pet bottles as much as possible. It might be because I try to be as eco-friendly as possible or because I'm cheap. I go to Combini's and I fill up my water bottle with smoking hot water, but it's free. This is the Akashi Kaikyo Bridge. I'm so glad I didn't make him crash right there. Like I was saying, this is the bridge that connects Awaji to Kobe and is rated the longest suspension bridge in the world, not because of its length, but because of the distance between the two gaps that actually allows it to suspend. Fun facts. I get to Awajishima. It is absolutely incredible.
that stuff. See, it's just the current. But if you look, if you look on a map, yeah. the whirlpool itself is actually in the middle of the uh, bridge. This is where you currently see me talking about something I know nothing about. Yes, I tend to do that quite often from MSI. The islands coming together and the mm. currents making a whirlpool. So I'm just in Awaji Island. It is coming up on the end of my first day here. And I found out something interesting that they are known for. Two bridges, yes, they have the world's longest suspension bridge. But there is one more thing that Awaji Island is known for. Tama Tamanegi, right? Tamanegi? Tamanegi. Hi, Tamanegi onion. They are known for their onions. Oh my god, it's eating a bee. I'm getting footage of this hornet eating a bee right now. Dude, check this out. We did some parkour, which I'm very excited to show you soon enough. I'm going to try this. We ended up going cliff diving. Everything this guy does is parkour. Everyone's going past the borders. Nihongo scores to go man side. Naniji, oh, yeah, I need to go say that. Oh, Canada, Kara Kimashita. Hi, Vancouver. Yeah. Yeah. Stop. Corona. Corona. I can't go home. Hi. Nihon Daisuke. Yeah. Hi. Wow. 
Bajji Island. Nice. Turns out we were breaking some of the rules. I really want to know what this says. Don't go inside. <laughs> it was really fun though, and I can't wait to go back to Awajishima and explore more and eat some delicious tamanegi. If you like this video, please hit the like button and subscribe. I really appreciate any support. I'm going to do a segment where I answer any questions that come my way about Canada, Japan, current situation going on here. If you have any questions, please feel free to comment below. Thank you. Matane.